I feel like Vitafly gonna recap this and say God he caught a 30 on the dime roll. So all y'all wanna know what happened, I'm gonna tell you what happened. He got smoked. That one was crazy out of the game. Sometimes that's Peter, nobody that knows body. Hit his area with 51. Everything in the Vitafly. We used to rapping like that. You know they got me slipping like my sneaker sliding. Well, let me get a grip then. And we gonna put that pressure on them all night and keep applying. Salute to the subscribers, that notification gang. Yeah, 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 I haven't said that in a little while. But um, I hope all is well out there. If you want what I got on, that beloved joint is on ricegang.myshopify.com. It's gonna only be a limited quality of these joints out. Um, salute to Keese, you know what I'm saying? Somebody had hollered at me on the Twitter and was like, yo, we should come up with like, you should come up with like special iconic moments in battle rap for some rice gang joints, you know what I'm saying? Let me get close. I get closer, I get closer, I get closer. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Hmm, think about it, think about it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So, um, let's get into it. So, Swamp, salute to Swamp and everything that he's got going on personally and professionally. I usually say that when it comes to all battle rappers as far as with what they got going on in their careers because um, without their careers, we really wouldn't be entertained and, you know, I really wouldn't have nothing going on with this YouTube shit. But, uh, so, um, he's been... Talking a lot, he's been on the live streams a lot. I may put some of his live stream at the end, you know what I'm saying? He's talking, you know, going back and forth with T-Top. Uh, T-Top had blocked him on um, socials media, you know what I'm saying? He blocked him, or whatever the case may be, you know, Barack Oblaka, him, but he said that he was still talking about him, you know, he was going into some things. Um, he has a battle coming up with Tay Rock. Um, what had happened was, you know, I, I backfill y'all, you know what I'm saying? I know some of y'all, you know, Take, let me rock y'all to sleep with it, you know what I'm saying? He, um, he has a battle coming up with Tay Rock. So, the questionable individual that Tay Rock has been associated with or accused of having communications with, whoever this transsexual person is, you know what I'm saying? I don't know, I don't get involved with these things, it's not really my, my lane or my, 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 my thing, per se. Um, so this person jumped on a live stream with Swamp and they were having a conversation you know the person was saying that they got receipts I haven't seen no receipts I don't go looking for receipts with you it's not my thing like I said it's not my thing so the person was on a live stream the transsexual saying that they know this and that and they got receipts and then I know a lot of people be like oh Vada why you ain't talk about it because I haven't really seen no concrete evidence besides this person just making these accusations but um they said that they're going to come to the battle. They said that they got all of this proof that they was allegedly with, allegedly with Rock. You know what I'm saying? Rock, I don't know. Like, this, is, this, is, this is weird, my Gs. I don't know. I'm just calling like I call it so I don't sport it. So anyway, um, T-Top found out about Swamp having this conversation with this person. So he then asked, did the chicken cross the road? Or did the road cross the chicken? Which one came first, the chicken or the egg? Who was the one in communication? Did Swamp DM the transsexual or did the transsexual DM Swamp? This is weird here. This is, oh, no, I don't want no hands on it. So anyway, Swamp got, you know, he was feeling the type of way that T-Top was making these accusations about him being involved with this person, which is the reason why he went on live. Uh, Swamp also has a battle coming up with none other than New Jersey Twerk. You know what I'm saying? Um, New Jersey Twerk has been under some scrutiny for his battle with Geechee Gotti. You know, a lot of people was talking about Geechee Gotti 3 0, whatever the case may be. That's how I called it. That's how a lot of other people called it. And um, now it's coming out that New Jersey Twerk has recycled again. You know what I'm saying? Again. Can't even say it. Like, like, I think he got mad when I recapped him versus Sway when he was sliding off the tail with a recycle that he, that he used that before. And now he's got more recycled bars versus Geechee Gotti. Swamp put the, well, somebody else put the video out. And Swamp had put the video on Instagram of some bars that new YouTube converter. Silence him on the MP. I can shoot through a person. Break down the audio. That's the YouTube converter. That's the audio. Silence him on the MP. I can shoot through a person and break down the audio. That's a YouTube converter. All you do is get served with. That's crazy. YouTube converter muffled the sound. YouTube converter. He used the bars versus oops. The battle versus oops just dropped like a day or so ago. It happened, I think, or maybe a month or two ago. And we was asking for the battle with oops. Him, the battle versus him and oops is actually pretty fire.
But now it's coming out that he recycled, used some of the line. Well, one of the lines, I don't know. He recycled so much, he's got in Captain Planet by now. So I don't even know what battles he be using lines from. But all throughout the comments, people are, are, are revering to battles that he used lines from and all this other shit. You know what I'm saying? And this is a battle that he... If he will recycle versus Geechee, got it. He will recycle versus anybody. You know what I'm saying? Billboards and everything. It don't matter. They put billboards in the sky. Big billboards. Big business. Big money. Caffeine. Even Drake. Even Drake couldn't even get this nigga to stop from recycling. You know what I'm saying? And I, I know. I know. He's going to feel away. But you know what I'm saying? If you don't recycle, we ain't got to talk about it. I know everybody ain't going to talk about it. But you know, it is what it is. It happened in the battle, right? It happened in the battle. You know what I'm saying? It's the same event where, you know, he went um, Macho Man Twerk Savage. <laughs> Where you know he went um, macho man twerk savage, you know what I'm saying, and, and, and used his best punches on norms. I mean, it is what it is, you know what I'm saying. I gotta call it like I call it so I can't spoil it, you know what I'm saying. So Twomp, um, <laughs> this shit's crazy, man. And this is like this is like the face. This is supposed to be the face. This is why I said that Ichigati was the face of battle rap, the face of the future. When everybody was coming around talking all that. Oh, which one of them is going to be the face and who's going to be the logo in the future? I'm like, the future? It's clearly Geechee Gotti. You know, he's showing up to all his battles. He's not recycling. Yeah, he battles a little bit more than he probably should, but he ain't using no material from another battle. And that's the one thing about battle rappers. Not just Macho Man Twerk Savage. Not just him. But battle rappers in general. You think that people are not going to do the due diligence. They will do the due diligence to find out if you used any material from a previous battle, like why do you think that? Like, do you think that? And the one that didn't even drop, do you think we was not gonna watch? Oops, versus. Did you think we wasn't gonna watch that? I can't even ask you when you start. We need. Wait, why don't you stop rapping like that? Like, come on, like you ain't even prepared for Kichi Gotti. You used pre. No, 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 no. So they caught him and they put the material out. And I know he blocks half of his fan base every fucking block. So he probably don't even see what half the people are saying. But you know what I'm saying? The fans are uh, going in about him um, recycling material versus Geechee. And this is supposed to be one of the bigger battles, like your biggest look and on a new app and on a caffeine stream and all this other shit. Don't matter. I'm still recycling. Um, So Geechee Gotti and... um. And um, Oops commented on the recycled bars. My man Oops said, you know what's crazy? It was only one bar and it got this impact. I was at Genesis, but our battle hadn't dropped. And I didn't remember that bar. He snapped in our battle. Hate this is going to take away from a good battle, but I feel you though. Gigi Gotti said, I don't think one bar takes away, champ. Y'all battle was fire. I F with it. Besides, the bar ain't hit against me, but against you, bro. So it hit. Same bar. YouTube conversion. YouTube conversion. It hit verse one. It ain't hit verse the other one. You know what I'm saying? And then he, you know he kind of wanted it to hit in the other one. Because he was like, that's crazy. It ain't crazy because they heard it before, motherfucker. It ain't crazy no more. It ain't crazy, YouTube converter. But, uh, you know, so they, they they both commented on it. Um, I still thought the battle versus Swamp was a I mean, not the battle versus Swamp. The battle versus, um, oops, it's a good battle. But when you're watching, you're, you, 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 now you're listening to every fucking bar to see if you heard it before. It is what it is. You know what I'm saying? Don't get, you don't get mad at me for speaking on it. Be mad that you recycle. How about that? But, um... So, JC and um, Averb, and that's enough of that, you know what I'm saying? Swamp said what he said, but Swamp is very vocal uh, about these type of things, you know what I'm saying? He posted it on his Instagram, you know what I'm saying? Instagram, it's there. It's public information, you know what I'm saying? Like, don't get mad for me to speak on. I didn't have to go far or try to find this, you know what I'm saying? It's right there on the timeline. Now, matter of fact, people be acting me, acting me in this. Salute to be the king. Advada fly. How do you recycle against Geechee though? 
Another dude, my man White Hog Five. Twerk finna become an app nigga. You know what I'm saying? Like people, they they talking. Like your fans, the, the fans will talk. That's the one thing. Like y'all, like the artists feel like the artists. You can block whoever you want, artist wise. But don't think the fans ain't gonna talk. And don't think that people with channels are not gonna talk. You know what I'm saying? We talk about battles. We talk about what happens in battles. And this is something that happened in one. So it is what it is, right? Yeah. Good. Boop. Bop. Bow. So um. My man JC, him and um A Verb talking that talk, talking that sauce talk. Uh Verb said, Hey, JC, I hear you, little man. You just got yourself an invite to Sparta St. Louis Verb versus JC this summer. Let's go, Verb. It's that time. Saying, you know, it's time to make it happen. And then my man Danny Myers chimed in on that. I'm just throwing all of this in one. I'm just you're getting two for one. Just keep watching. I'm gonna keep dropping. Like you know what I'm saying. I'm gonna just keep on. Let's just let's just let's just keep this thing going. Let's just marinate. I'm gonna just keep going for y'all. Should I give them more? Give them more. Should I give them more? Give them more. I give them more. You know what I'm saying. I, 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 you like what I write, boy? Well, guess what? I'm gonna spit what I spit from the heart. And I ain't gonna recycle. So, Danny Myers says, I want to see JC versus A Verb, two of the best lyricists the Midwest ever produced. It's amazing they haven't been in the ring. The both they will both undoubtedly be remembered as gifted writers once they retire, but this will be a personal testament. This will be so you know Danny Myers, he starts speaking all political. This will be a personal testament, something that I want to see. Whoop de whoop, blah de blah. Now verb, you know what I'm saying, while he is, you know, a cool character, he's definitely gonna talk his talks. A verb said, yeah, but the difference is. Our status ain't the same. I cannot battle JC and still be who I am if JC don't get the big matches that mean something. He will forever be a top tier mid guy. He has skill, but I give chill when I walk in the room saying that basically you're going to be a high mid tier app franchise battling, you know, Don Marino battling. Gooeasy battling app tier mid level nigga. Like, you're not getting some madness, no more, none of that. He's basically saying now, JC has been on Summer Madness. He battled Rum Nitty. He actually shook up. He shook shit up versus Rum Nitty. Um, I like Verb. I like JC. Uh, A Verb was in that same little area that he was talking about. JC was in about a year or two ago. He was definitely, he was definitely there. You battled, he was battling against the Jimses and you battled against uh, Bonnie Godivers and shit like that. You was definitely there. I remember before you talk with me, take this walk with me, you was there. Now, what you have done since then is you have elevated. It should be celebrated that you elevated. You know what I'm saying? It should be celebrated that you elevated. And um, separation creates elevation. You've separated yourself from that level that you were on. So you can talk that talk now. Because you know with the moot battle. And then you turned around and you had the battle versus uh, Loaded Lux. You know what I'm saying? You're supposed to battle Iron Solomon. You ducked that one. I get it. I get it. I get it. You know? You got bigger looks. You had bigger looks, so I, I, I do respect it. Respectively, I do respect it. But um, now we're talking about you versus JC. I would actually like it, though. Um, I think in order for JC to become that next level guy, he's got to take stop taking these subsidiary matches. Like, he's got to literally be like, look, if it ain't the right match, I ain't taking it. You know what I'm saying? Like, you can't just take every single name that's out there for you. And um, somebody who did speak about just taking random battles or taking the wrong battles, uh, John John Adon, you know what I'm saying? Like, why don't you give him more? Give him more. Give him more? Give him more. Um, he said, battling every week brings your stock and numbers down. Doesn't matter who you are, up and coming battlers. Don't oversaturate yourself to stay relevant. Go for the fights that's gonna mean something. Go for the fights that's gonna mean something. He's actually going for a fight right now with Sue Surf. Uh, John John Adon does not take a bunch of random battles. You know what I'm saying? He rarely even battles on his own league. Bullpen, but he don't. You don't see him up there battling every week against Joe Blow, this nigga, that nigga. And he had, he owns a motherfucking league. He owns a league. You know what I'm saying? The only thing, the only place where 
you could do stuff every day of the week and people watch is shit like this right here. Like when you bring content like this right here, you know what I'm saying? The numbers ain't going to ain't going to dwindle because, you know, y'all want to know what we got to talk about. So, you know, the numbers the the number I hold on, I recycle that my bad. But the numbers ain't going to you know, recycling for the planet is good, but it's not good for battle rap. But uh, somebody told me that too. One of my subscribers on notification gang, he was spitting some knowledge up in there. You know what I'm saying? I, I told him I was gonna steal that. I stole it. So what? Yeah, fuck it. Um, but John John Don said uh, he he basically said that um, you know, Lux won't be surf, but I will. But I will. Uh oh, but I will. He said Lux won't be surf. Lux not gonna win. Lux gonna get talked to. Lux gonna get you know what I'm saying? They gonna be in that room. He gonna start doing that Raiden shit, Raiden Fish, Raiden Smith, Jaden Smith shit that Sue Surf be doing. Get the crowd all behind him, and he gonna have a debatable with Lux. That's what he's saying. That's what John John's saying. But John John's coming fresh off of. That <sighs> way do my boy like that, man. I'm from calling that. Why you do my boy like that, damn dog? Why you do just like that, John John? Why you do just like that? And it's funny that every time John John smoke a nigga, they never want to give him the props. It's going to always be an excuse. Oh, this was happening. Oh, that was happening. It was funny how when he was battling Chess, the stream was glitchy, but we still knew that Chess was choking in that motherfucking battle. I did not need, you know what I'm saying? It was crazy. I bang mine. Do you believe in a parallel universe? I do. How the stream was glitching. And chess was glitching at the same damn time, my nigga. That shit was happening at the same. That shit was happening simultaneously. The stream was, and chess was like, it was like a fucking double remix type shit. You know what I'm saying? So I did watch it again. I they got apps for that. Y'all niggas want to see it again? Yeah, they got apps for that. I, I'm not. I don't believe in um sharing like shit like that. But if it come my way, I'm gonna watch it. I'm, I, 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 will, I will watch it. <laughs> I really don't give a fuck. But other than that, you already know what doing what it does. You ain't gotta ask what it was. Salute to the subscribers. That notification gang, rice gang my shopify.com. Showtime will be back tomorrow. You dig? Hmm, hmm. Think about it. Think about it. Like I said, these joints right here is gonna be limited. So if you miss it, you miss it. Gone.